For the bracket assembly, we'll use acrylic parts one, two, and three. One, two, and three. You'll need two M3 by 16 millimeter bolts. And to put these together, we're gonna stack them. So you're gonna have one first, two on top, and then three. Be sure when tightening these bolts that you just get a firm contact. Do not over tighten these. So now that we have the first part of the bracket assembly done, we're going to continue the second part. So you're going to need part four and part five. And you're going to need M3 by 10 millimeter bolts, two of them. So for this, you're going to put part four behind part five and you use the same two holes that you use for the prior part. And you just screw those in. When assembling these two pieces, you want to be sure the numbers are facing in the same direction. This is going to be very important in the later part of the build. To continue with the bracket assembly, we're going to need acrylic parts E and D. And of course your bottom bracket assembly and your top bracket assembly. You're going to need M3 by 16 millimeter bolts, six of them, and six nuts, M3 nuts. So by taking your bottom assembly with the flat side facing up, you're going to take your letter E part. And you want to make sure your letter E is facing up and connect it with the bottom bracket. And your letter D part, make sure your letter D part is facing down. And place it in place there. D facing down. E facing up. Once you have the bracket pressed together, you need to put a nut in each square opening on the DNE pieces, one by one, with an M3 by 16 bolt. Now to assist with this section, to make it a little easier, you can put two, two of the nuts together and slide them into the square hole. Now this is tricky, but with a little patience, you can get it in there. There we go. Now with your nuts in place, held by your finger in the back, put your bolt, your M3 by 16 bolt in. As soon as you start getting traction with the first nut, go ahead and let the other nut fall out. And just compress fit, don't over tighten. 